Hey guys, what's going on? So this is my school hack compilation. School hacks are actually my most popular series on TikTok, so I thought you guys would like it if I compiled them into one video and uploaded them on YouTube, like I've seen some other people do. So I'm not gonna be too long this time. There should be a new YouTube video next weekend, but until now, enjoy these school hacks. These are two school hacks that will change your life. Do you have a test coming up and you don't feel like studying? Well, roll up your sleeve and write down all of the answers on your arm in Sharpie. While you're taking your test, if your teacher asks any questions, just say you got a new tattoo. Number two, if you're in class and your teacher says you had a homework assignment due and you forgot to do it, quickly pull out your phone and learn all of sign language. Then, in sign language, tell the teacher you didn't do the homework assignment because you couldn't hear what she said. These are two school hacks that will change your life. Number one, do you want to get out of running the mile in gym? Quickly write a note that says a trusted doctor said you can't run. And then give the note to your gym teacher. They're going to have to believe you because the note's from a trusted doctor. Number two, if you walk into class and you realize you forgot you had an essay due, run to the nearest computer and copy and paste a picture of the Declaration of Independence. Then print that out and hand it in. Your teacher will have to give you an A because this will make her think that you're the one who wrote the Declaration of Independence. These are two school hacks that will change your life. Number one, do you want to use your phone during class, but your teacher won't let you? All you have to do is get some duct tape. And then tape your phone to the back of the person's head who is sitting in front of you. Now you will easily be able to use your phone during class without your teacher seeing you. Number two, are you bored of school and you want to go home? Well, tell your teacher you feel sick so she'll send you to the nurse. And then while you're waiting for the nurse, ask all the sick people to cough on you. This will spread their illness to you so by the time you see the nurse, she'll have to send you home. These are two school hacks that will change your life. Number one, if the teacher calls on you and you don't know the answer, make sure you have a blender. Plug the blender in, turn it on, and then pretend to answer the question. Your teacher will not be able to hear you over the sound of the blender, so she'll think you answered the question right. Number two, are you tired and want to sleep but you're in class? Take a selfie of yourself smiling and then print it then out. Then take the printed out picture and tape it to your face. This will allow you to sleep while your teacher will think that you're just really enjoying class. These are two school hacks that will change your Number life. Number one, if you go to class and you realize you forgot the homework, pull out a blank sheet of paper and tell your teacher you did the homework in invisible ink. The teacher will have to believe you because they can't see invisible ink. Number two, if you have a test in class that you didn't study for, hang the answers to the test right outside the classroom. Then pull out your binoculars. Then use the binoculars to see the answers that you hung up outside. Your teacher will not suspect anything because she'll think you're just having a good time bird watching. These are two school hacks that will change your life. Number one, if you go to class and your teacher says you have homework, make sure you pull out your Uno reverse card. If you use this card, your teacher will have to do your homework for and you. And that means you'll get all the homework answers right. Number two, if it's a really nice day and you want to skip school, write a note that says you can't go to school. And make sure you say the notes from your mom. Then go to your school and drop the note off. The people at your school will have to believe the note because it's from your mom.